Now, in England, who's going to win the Premiership? Tonight, we look at two of the serious title contenders, Liverpool and Newcastle. First to Anfield, where under Roy Evans, Liverpool appear to be getting stronger and stronger. Today's opponents were Blackburn, who clinched the title on their last visit to Merseyside. But this season, Rovers have just four points from five games and lost at home in the Champions League in midweek. Liverpool recalled striker Robbie Fowler to play alongside Stan Collymore, but only a place on the bench for latest signing Jason McAteer. Under pressure, Blackburn manager Ray Harford, who's admitted he's missing the influence of Kenny Dalgleish in team affairs and has brought in a new coach, kept five million pound striker Chris Sutton on the bench with Mike Newell partnering Alan Shearer. Highlights with Clive Tilsley. Colin Moore played quite deep. Jones. Played by Hendry. Got away from Berg. Broke the challenge of Kenner. And a dollar from Pierce. What a run. Fowler! What a tremendous burst that was by Steve Hartness. Power packed. There were some big men that he was running through there. And he got a little break at the end. And Fowler was just unable to capitalise. Had a good spell of late, uh, Steve Harkness. Ray Harp has made some pretty frank and public admissions in the last week or so, talking of Blackman as a provincial club, who have come a long way, almost too quickly to, to sustain. Said that they should have bought more in the summer. He suggested that for the moment they can only really play one way, one style. opening to the season for everybody at the club. Barnes. Right arriving, important headed by Pierce Rittner. Reflected off the so it'll be a corner kick. Jamie Rednap can strike them much better than that. Came to him in an awkward height, didn't really get hold of it. He's got another chance here. Got hold of that all right. Screamer! A goal for Liverpool in 12 minutes. A thunderbolt from the right foot of Jamie Redknapp. Well, he scored a beauty in Russia last week. Well, that was enough to win the game for Liverpool. And having just rather scuffed an effort a few moments earlier, he hit Anola with power and bend to put the team in front. Jones. Through towards Fowler. Oh, he didn't expect it to arrive. Robbie Fowler just checked. He thought Pierce was going to cut it out. Eye of the needle stuff, wasn't it? Just too long for Pierce. Fowler couldn't get there either. Shearer. up. Bam, who uh, smothered the danger. It's an awkward bounce for Pierce. Very awkward. Here's Fowler. Collymore up with him. This is Stan Collymore. He couldn't quite get it under control. Matt Manaman. Jones. Oh. by Pierce. Fowler didn't take a gamble on the near post. The defender got there first as a result. Jones is still forward, only nominally a defender. Now Fowler, now it's two. He saw that one coming. 
got himself in front of the defender and that was the end of the story he does have a real eye for goal an uncommon eye look for goal for a 20 year old Robbie Fowler and having chalked up his half century for Liverpool at Tottenham last month he's taken guard and started on another 50 2 0 Liverpool lead less than a quarter of the match play it's getting worse for Blackburn Ripley Ooh, just touched away from Sherwood by Jones it's a good cross from Jones but the important thing was how Fowler stole a yard on Burke to get there. Made it his. Derek Fazakli is the man in the foreground who's returned to Blackburn this week from Newcastle United to take over as first team coach. Lovely composure about a lot of Liverpool's approach play. Barnes. McManaman. Fowler. Always probing, but if they don't find a gap, not frightened to go back to square one and start again. Not frightened to go long towards Collymore either. He's got it from Ripley. Got away from the soil. And from Ripley down. He went eventually, but convincing stumble and deep shearers come here don't want to keep it in for Kenny Sherwood Bab only for Batty Newell trying to lift it to Sherwood Lifted enough. Collymore having a shirt tucked, but he is a very strong man. Matt Manaman. Hartness. Matt Manaman allowed to turn. Fowler. Collymore. He's done it again in his second game for Liverpool here. A brilliant goal from Steph Collymore. And Liverpool are flying here. It's his left foot again. That's not a bad weak foot, is it? He knew exactly what he was doing. Breathtaking stuff. And Liverpool lead by three goals to nil and we're not at the half hour mark yet. Two good goals and one outstanding goal. Matt Hanneman. Redknapp. Fowler to his left, not much to his right. Tipped by Berg. I think Berg's already been shown a yellow card. His afternoon is going to come to the to an end here. Ooh, and Berg didn't seem to go through with the challenge, did he? Second yellow, equals red. This is Blackburn's sixth league game of the season, and that is their third red card of the season. Fowler! Well, 
be a puzzle to Tim Flowers as to just how Robbie Fowler was allowed to get in the shot on target there. Cross came past one, two, three defenders really. Blackburn going about their business with industry, but there isn't the uh, accuracy about their play or the cutting edge that Liverpool have got. Fowler into the path of McManaman and it needed Pierce. Flat Blackman display a bubbling Liverpool performance. Ruddock's there, poked away by Sutton this time. <laughs> Red nap in towards Barnes, and now Collymore! <laughs> Didn't begin to get hold of it. Amazing to think where he scored from in the first half and with the same foot from what six yards he just about caught it with his heel does have a rather casual air but Blackburn are not an easy side to pass through there's Batty and Sherwood snapping at you and there's Shearer and Newell who are willing to chase defenders in possession Biles has got this from Sherwood McManaman Bad error by Tim Sherwood. Uh, John Barnes seized upon it. And compared to what's gone before, a bad finish from Steve McManaman. Jeff Kenner, who was just back from injury, is being replaced by Lee Makel. <laughs> Offside foul this time. Thumping header from right. Sherwood needed the save from James. Tim Sherwood's name has been appearing in the transfer gossip columns this week. One or two jeers from one or two home fans that he would part for the uh, skipper last weekend. Amazing, really, a championship captain, PFA award nominee last year. Hendry, play by Ruddock, he has showed again, blocked by Ruddock, Makel, goal kick, despite the appeals for the corner. Sherwood shot was well hit, Makel's found a way through, but wide of David Jones's post.